neat. I view this really as your secret weapon. Here's the problem with it. If you're not actively tracking it, as you start to do harder workouts, as you do caloric restriction, you might actually decrease your NEAT because your body adapts to what you're doing to maintain homeostasis and can drop your NEAT. And in fact, NEAT can vary between people as much as 1,000 to 2,000 calories a day. This is why the first thing I have someone do when I start working with them is start to track their NEAT, track their activity all throughout the day. Because I want to make sure that if you're adding an intentional exercise or you are doing any kind of caloric restriction, you aren't compensating by dropping down that non-activity uh, thermogenesis. So what do you got to do? You got to start by tracking it. First thing you're looking at is how many steps you're taking throughout the day. Your floor, like the non-negotiable, is to get to 8,000 steps a day, no matter what, okay? The goal is going to be to do higher than that, but the first step is always 8,000 steps a day. Once you get to there, then go to 10,000 a day, then go to 12,000 a day. But the very first thing that I want you to think about is how do I get to 8,000 steps a day? One of the things I love is walking after a meal, especially dinner, because it's going to help with digestion, help get you ready for sleep. Stand rather than sit, walk rather than stand, take the stairs whenever possible, like look throughout your life and go, how can I just move more all throughout the day? And by the way, like let's say you had a desk job. If you could move into a more physically demanding job, you could increase your need by like 1200 calories a day. I mean, it's crazy. Or put a little alarm on your phone, five minutes every hour, get up, move around. I do this naturally because I just drink a ton of fluids. <laughs> so I'm always having to get up and move around. I mean, in the perfect world, when you think about it, you would have like your office on your top floor of your house and have to run down three flights of stairs to go to the bathroom and run back up, something like that. But look at all the different ways that you can move more throughout the day. You're monitoring neat to make sure that you aren't lowering your total daily energy expenditure, 